you know, you have to have the conversation is the first thing. And then you have to document it in some way what the decision was and who made it. Um, and you should enforce it in contracts, right? And, um, you know, you can do risk waivers. Um, you can do risk acceptance. I mean, all these things, they should be part, they should be core to an MSP's business. Because really, like, we had that conversation about business owners do care about risk, right? So if you have the risk conversation instead of the technology conversation, all of a sudden that customer actually wants to talk about security. <laughs> if you talk about security in terms of what the end client understands, and I'm, I, you know, I used to be one of those end clients, so I'll tell you what we understand. We understand people and processes. If you lead with the tech, it's not going to digest. You have to lead with the thing your end client knows already, speak their language, and then once you've done that, then you can educate them. Um, but you've got to start in the space that they know. And, and if they're running a business that isn't technical, it's because they know how to take care of people and they know how to manage people and they know how to run a process. And Br Brad's leaving us with his takeaway here. <laughs> I like Brad. I like Brad, too. <laughs>